Yawn. I'm so gosh darn exhausted. That was the most worst nightmare that I've had ever since I left the crazy Pollywood music industry. Wait, when weren't you supposed to go to bed? Merrily, you've got to be kidding me. We both live in the same house together. How is it that you didn't know when I was supposed to go to sleep? I just had a lot of stuff going on in my mind last night. Come on. You can't keep blaming me for not being that for you. It's just that I also have not been able to get some rest either. Look, I don't seem to give a single freak what you have to say. All you do is just act like taking care of me is nothing but a gosh darn joke. And I don't think that is very nice at all. Dude, none of that crap is true. And yet you still believe it is, why? Because of the fact that you ain't just a male to female, but you are just as crazy as I am. Alright, now you just made me mad. What are you gonna do about it? The truth hurts, doesn't it? Oh, that seriously hurt. How could you do that? One minute later. Ugh, what? What the heck just happened? I don't think that I remember. All I do remember was that insane argument that you and I just had. But there's one thing that I don't get. Why the tail did I feel like I was under some sort of trance? Ooh, I know. Maybe our teacher is some kind of magician or something. <laughs>